Hi, and welcome to our session on the Google Workspace Developer Platform and how, together with our partners, Miro, DocuSign, Adobe and Atlassian, we are leveraging the platform to make compelling improvements to common workflows that you and your colleagues encounter every day. I'm Matthew Isat, Group Product Manager at Google and the product lead for Google Workspace's extensibility and partnerships efforts. I'll also be joined by David Grabner, product lead at Miro, to talk about how Miro makes Google Workspace the hub for work. In this session, we'll do an overview of the developer platform overall, spotlight some essential partner integrations, and hear a testimonial from Miro, the online collaborative whiteboard platform that brings teams together anytime, anywhere. Let's get started with an overview of the Google Workspace developer platform. Everyone is familiar with Google Workspace. Workspace is everything you need to get anything done now in one place. Google Workspace includes all of the productivity apps you know and love. Gmail, Calendar, Drive, Docs, Sheets, Slides, Meet, and many more. Whether you're returning to the office, working from home, on the front lines with your mobile device, or connecting with customers, Google Workspace is the best way to create, communicate, and collaborate. What you might be less familiar with is the Google Workspace developer platform. The developer platform is a flexible, intelligent, and secure platform that empowers developers to tightly integrate into it while allowing users to customize and automate how they work. And when I say developer, yes, I certainly mean a professional software developer who writes code for a living, but I also mean a person who wants to automate a repetitive workflow who may never have coded at all. The Workspace platform is for all types of developers. That flexibility is key, and it's available to all Google Workspace users and customers today. I want to start by giving you an idea of the size of the Google Workspace ecosystem. There are over 3 billion monthly active users depending on Google Workspace, ranging from folks running their personal lives and kids' soccer teams, to sole proprietorships like your accountant or lawyer, to the largest companies on the planet, in industries ranging from aerospace to financial services. All of them have access to thousands of integrated business apps to help them get their work done. The result is over a billion app installs from developers in the ecosystem, both large and small. I mentioned thousands of business apps. You know and are familiar with many of them. Here's an example of some of our amazing partners developing deep integrations for Google Workspace. I'll let you read some of the names and feel free to go visit the Workspace Marketplace to see all of them. In this session, we'll show you some specific examples and we'll see more from Miro, DocuSign, Adobe, and Atlassian later in this session. So let's take a look at what we mean when we say the Google Workspace Developer Platform. The platform starts with data, your data. Your data lives in a variety of forms. It may be inside Google Workspace or outside its own, or both. Maybe it's in a spreadsheet, a database, Drive, a third-party application. However your data currently exists, it's accessible within the Workspace Developer Platform. And the core of the platform itself is composed of frameworks that both end users and professional developers can leverage. Let's start with no-code or low-code options for both end users as well as more professional developers. AppSheet, along with AppScript, gives users the ability to extend their Google Workspace functionality with custom apps, automations, and workflows. These no-code and low-code platforms also make it easy for end users to connect to other SaaS and IT services, both within and outside of Google, connecting and simplifying disparate software and processes. For professional coders, we also have rich solutions like add-ons, chat apps, and a complete library of RESTful APIs. These frameworks and APIs are what you and builders use to create integrations, extensions, and customizations while leveraging the entire core platform from top to bottom. Whatever you want to build, you start here. Let's look at some of the platform's components in a little more detail, starting with Google Workspace add-ons. Workspace add-ons enable a whole new opportunity for developers to integrate their solutions right within Google Workspace in context. So what do I mean by they work in context? Well, think how an average worker uses Google Workspace today. Google Workspace isn't the only set of applications they use. They spend a lot of time there, but they also use a lot of other apps, sales and CRM apps, finance apps, e-signature apps, and for the developers watching, maybe even your apps. Consider a scenario where a user gets an email they need to take action on. Maybe they have to switch over to another tab into a CRM to look up customer info. Perhaps they copy some information like customer orders from the CRM and then toggle back to Gmail with that data and to cut and paste it into the response to the email. Then maybe they need to look up invoices or inventory details or shipping information, all requiring different apps 
or different parts of the same app. This is one workflow that you might do many times daily. By embedding the business apps used today into Workspace, you can perform tasks and pull information on one screen to help you be more efficient and make better decisions. If you've been watching the graphic, you've seen how a CRM add-on can not only provide relevant information side by side to an email, but more importantly, it provides contextually relevant information. The CRM app understands the email content and is taking the user to the exact right context related to the customer in the email. The same add-ons you use also carry over to mobile scenarios for apps like Gmail and calendar conferencing. The add-ons you use on your laptop work on mobile too and in the exact same way. And what we've heard from our partners is that Google Workspace add-ons are a great way for them to build towards the greater good of all our users and customers. DocuSign is a partner who has over 4 million app installs in the Workspace marketplace with an average rating over four stars. If you're watching the video, you're seeing this power at work. It showcases how easy it is to upload and sign an email attachment with DocuSign eSignature. Completing agreements with the DocuSign eSignature for Google Workspace integration is easy, time-saving, and secure. Leverage the power of DocuSign while using your favorite Workspace apps like Drive, Docs, and Gmail. In the video, a Gmail user, Mary, is sent a document to sign as a Gmail attachment. She decides to sign and return the attachment using the DocuSign eSignature for Workspace integration. From the email, Mary selects the DocuSign integration, completes a simple signing step via DocuSign, including all the power of DocuSign to add fields and information. Once Mary adds her signature, she's done and immediately back in Gmail, all seamlessly integrated and easy to use. Similarly, Adobe recently deployed their Google Workspace add-on that integrates Adobe Creative Cloud across Gmail and your favorite Google Workspace apps. With the add-ons framework, Adobe was able to improve the overall performance and unify their Google Workspace and Gmail add-ons. This integration creates a much better experience for both Google Workspace and Adobe Creative Cloud users. Now let's move on to chat and chat apps. As more and more teams adopt chat as a real-time communications form within Google Workspace, chat apps are a great way to bring automation, actions, and information right into the conversations teams are having. This allows users to not miss a beat in their conversations while completing tasks, querying for information, interacting with other systems, and all while keeping focus on the mission they are really trying to accomplish. It helps them stay in the moment with the conversation without having to switch context and potentially break that chain. The newly updated Jira bot from Atlassian leverages all of the new functionality offered in chat apps. The Jira bot uses at mentions to bring it into the conversation, slash commands for quick actions, and dialogues for interactive flows. All these new features allow users to create issues quickly, see actionable previews, and monitor issues as they come in. For a development team, this means there is a single home for discussions around their day-to-day -day work. Dropping a URL into a stream gives them a rich view of the issue being discussed and keeps the team discussion all in one place and open for input and collaboration from the entire team. Google Cloud AppSheet is an intelligent no-code platform empowering users to build solutions rapidly, manage their data efficiently, and automate workflows to save time. It connects to a variety of data sources from Google Sheets to Salesforce. AppSheet empowers everyone to create custom applications and automations by leveraging the power of their data. IT and CISN developers can efficiently collaborate with governance and corporate policy capabilities. Together, they can create time-saving apps that integrate with the Google Workspace tools you already use. All of this and no professional development experience needed at all. Now, moving on to low code, AppScript is a low code development platform included with Google Workspace that makes it fast and easy to build custom business solutions for your favorite Google Workspace apps. AppScript is a natively integrated scripting language with easy access to Google Workspace APIs and events, helping you build custom business solutions from menus to macros and automations, all so that you can simplify your day to day routines. There's nothing to install or configure. It all runs server side and is based on the popular language JavaScript. But maybe you want direct access to the hundreds of APIs available and to call them for your own development environment using your own tools. The Google Workspace APIs provide more control over integration and personalization for organizations and businesses over their data. APIs enable custom workflows and processes to be created for greater efficiency within the business. Whether it's manipulating data in a spreadsheet, understanding files and drive storage, or conducting analyses on email, 
there's an API enabling access to that data from the Google Workspace developer platform. Finally, I'd like to mention the Workspace Marketplace. As a user, the Workspace Marketplace is a great place to browse, search, and evaluate business apps that are the best for you and your organization. Check out and find the apps that are right for you based on app descriptions, user ratings, and reviews. Find your favorite top tier business apps you use today in the Marketplace and install them with just a single click for a seamless experience. All the apps are trusted and secure. Be at ease knowing that all apps are evaluated and undergo a review and security check before being added to the Marketplace. As a developer, the Google Workspace Marketplace is the one place where you publish applications, giving you global visibility for all Google Workspace users, consumers, business users, and most importantly, Workspace Enterprise Administrators. While your application can be installed by end users after discovering it, it can also be deployed by domain-wide by an administrator across an organization after they've adopted the solution, not requiring the users in the organization to actually take action. With one click, the administrator can deploy domain-wide. The marketplace allows developers to reach global markets and generate new sales opportunities effectively, as it is tightly integrated with Workspace, making discoverability easier and more effective. But enough from me about the platform. Let's hear directly from one of Workspace's key partners on the benefits of the Workspace platform. Hi, I'm David Grabner, and I'm a product lead at Miro for apps and integrations. And thanks for having me today uh, to talk about how Miro makes Google Workspace the hub for work. First, let me give you a quick overview of how your teams can collaborate with Miro. Miro is a visual collaboration platform, and our mission is to empower teams to create the next big things by providing the best solutions for collaborations. We want to enable distributed teams to work effectively together from running brainstorm sessions and workshops to planning projects or designing new products and services up to facilitating agile ceremonies. We are excited to bring the Mirror experience to Google Workspace suite of tools. With our existing integration for Docs, Slides and Sheets and planned integrations for Google Calendar and Meet, we are unlocking new ways to collaborate for Google Workspace users and Miro. Today, teams can seamlessly embed and access their Google Workspace docs, sheets, slides in a Miro's infinite canvas. This makes it easier to visualize and manage all pieces of a project from one shared space to see how it all connects to the bigger picture. Users have the ability to edit the document right in Miro and organize the entire project on our infinite canvas. We are also really excited about our upcoming integrations with Google Calendar and Meet. With Google Calendar add-on, meeting organizers can attach and share a Miro board ahead of a meeting and workshop. This takes the headache out of the meeting setup for organizers and gives participants the access they need to make the meetings more productive. For the upcoming Google Meet add-on, teams will enable collaboration on a mirror board while seeing their collaborators on Google Meet at the same time. These new experiences will be available in early 2022, and we are excited to partner with Matthew and the Google team on this. Now back to you, Matthew. Thanks, David. There's a lot more to learn about Workspace, the developer platform, and our partners. There's many other sessions and also some great sources of information. If you're a developer, I invite you to sign up for our newsletter to learn about the latest developments at developer.google.com slash workspace slash newsletters. Thank you all for coming. And thank you, David, for joining me today.